Hello again, this is Mike at buyvet.net, Atlanta, Georgia. Today we're looking at a 2001 Corvette Coupe. <clears throat> this has a light pewter metallic exterior with a black interior. We rated the paint on this car as being in very good, excellent condition with a uh, great shine. It's kind of a cloudy day out, so we're not going to see a whole lot of shine on the paint, but as you can see, it's very nice. I'm going to walk you around the car. This does have a set of factory polished wheels on it. It would put it in very good condition. Um, I don't see any major pitting or um, there's no curb rash on these wheels at all. It has a set of uh, radial tires, about 65% of their tread life remaining. Um, see there's some minor scratching here, but um, nothing that looks like it wouldn't come, it wouldn't buff out and nothing that doesn't look like it wouldn't definitely wet sand out if we if the buffing didn't work. Um, as you can see here the paint continues to look very nice. Um, just a little tree sap there, nothing nothing bad. Um, there's one spot on this car I did notice when I was looking over the paint previously and uh, right here and you can see it um, yeah, appears to be a little bit cracking in the paint, a little chip. Um, that could be touched up fairly inexpensively if you wanted to. But I didn't even really notice it until about the second or third time I looked at the paint on this car. So it's not very alarming. Um, okay, go ahead and show you the inside. Start off here, we have an excellent condition door panel on the driver's side. Looks great. Um, you have to remember that now this is almost a nine-year-old car and I don't see too many O1s that have a door panel look like that. That just looks great. Um, we've got very good condition seats. You can see here we have um, a lot of heavy wrinkling on these seats which could develop into cracking. Um, but they look pretty good uh, overall. You can see here we do have a uh, looks to be coming apart at the seams. I don't know if I'd classify that as a rip or a tear, but it's definitely getting to that point. Also here, um, shoot, I, just, I want to be up front and let you know what you're getting with these cars. Uh, this seat is still in very good condition for being an 01. They have very good condition carpeting. Hop in here, show you some more. Um, as far as steering wheel, very good condition. Only some minor... Um, little fingernail impressions and things like that on it but besides that it looks great all the gauges are nice very clear all operational um, it has an excellent condition center console um, as you can see here this has a six-speed manual transmission with a short shifter which I love it's super fun to drive I highly recommend uh, the short shifters um, this doesn't have dual climate control just wanted to let everyone be aware of that. Um, this other seat's in very good condition as well. Just some minor wrinkles. I didn't see any uh, of the issues I saw on the driver's seat with it. Um, the back carpeting, very good to excellent condition with only some minor fading in some spots. It looks real nice. Uh, unfortunately, we do have that delamination issue here on the passenger door. But besides that, which is all too common. Um, the door look, panel looks really nice. Um, carpet over here, very good to excellent condition. Um, okay, let me show you underneath the hood. This has a um, LS1 engine. <clears throat> which is the start of the modern Corvette C5 engine. 350 horsepower, 5.7 liters. This one looks real nice. Um, got relatively low miles on this car. And uh, let's give you a couple angles of it. See, this looks like this has a new Everstart battery in it with very clean connectors, I don't see any corrosion. I mean for 50,000 miles 
or 50,000 and some change, I should say. This looks like it's in really nice condition. It sure drives nice. Cranked up, no problem, first try. Um, real smooth driving. And like I said, really fun to drive with that short stick. Short stick. So, I hope this will be a car that you consider. Um, it's definitely a nice entry level C5. Um, it's not weighted down with a bunch of options and it makes it a lot more affordable. So, uh, appreciate it if you go out and check out this car. Um, you can see some more detailed pictures on the right side. And I'd appreciate it if you check out all of our cars at buyavet.net. I do appreciate your time. Thanks.